For high schoolers, it's the first robotics competition. We got this, you guys. For middle schoolers like us, kids from the PBS TV show Zoom, it's the first Lego League. This is the Zoom team. We're building a robot. That's right! Follow us as we compete with 41 other teams to design, build, and program a robot. You do want to know how to sustain life on Mars, don't you? And present our research to a panel of judges. Get ready for the... First All right, here is our kit. What happens is we get a kit of parts with Legos and we're gonna build a little robot to go into a challenge. As a group, we work and perfect it all together. Look at the picture. There, there you go. go. Cause we're a team. So now we head over to the computers and it looks like our Mars. mission will be about Mars. Mars. Oh, Mars. All of the Legos that we're going to put together are gonna be different stations on the surface of Mars. That's cool. Okay, so we're gonna split up into three groups. Some people work on, you know, starting programming, others will work on research, and others will work on building. Building robots really fun because the pieces are different colored, so they're really cool to put together and stuff. Perfect, good job, guys. You also have to do a research project on Mars and figure out a fun way to present the information to the judges at the competition. Oxygen byproducts are used. I really like researching a lot and like, learning stuff and then relaying it back to everybody. Programming is when you go on the computer and tell the robot to do something. I'm having a little trouble with the turn, but I okay. think I fixed it. Yeah, it didn't work again. I'm telling it to wait until the rotation sensor senses 26, was it? Yeah. Negative 26. Negative Oh, oh that's yeah. the problem. Yeah. Oh, so I didn't put a negative sign. Oh, uh, okay, good thing we kind of pulled it together and said we have to, there's something wrong, we have to look for it. We didn't just assume that the robot was broken, so. This is how a real competition will work. I'll okay. be the ref. Three, two, one. Oh. 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 Okay, right. we'll do that. Careful, 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 careful Mike. Yes. 18, so I'm feeling pretty good and in shape about the composition. I can't wait because it seems like we got everything just in time. I would like to introduce all of these hard-working champion teams. So what's going to happen today is we're going to play a total of three matches and they're going to look at your best score and that score is going to be ranked against all the other teams that are here and then the teams with the top eight scores are gonna go into the elimination rounds. All right, show us your robot, guys. All right. Our robot just being, it's really, really simple, but it works well. We so how do you turn it? Whether um, just one wheel go, like have the wheels go opposite direction. So we'll go forward and reverse. Yep. Yeah. Yes. Thank you very much. Thank you. Have fun, Good job. Good job. Good job. Team two, two scientists and a robot hard at work, interrupted by a tour of humans visiting the planet Mars. The plants will be watered and we'll use their oxygen byproducts. We'll also have an oxygen generator which will produce 23 cubic feet of oxygen per hour. Please welcome on table number one, Zoom! <laughs> Zoom gets two ice cores. Zoom successfully launches their sample canister and knocks the dust off their solar panel. And Zoom gets another habitation module hooked up and knocks the rover off the sand dune. And Zoom's robot gets in the crater with 30 seconds left. They are mission accomplished. I am so excited because we just got like everything that is definitely the best we've done and it's so exciting! Are you ready? Judge Jason to come forward. Team 1101, Zoom. 
The Zoom team won the Teamwork Award because we're such a great team. We're, we're like brothers and sisters. We always listen to each other and we listen to each other carefully. Director's Award. This most prestigious award goes to the team who, in the big picture, is the strongest in all categories combined. First place for this year's Director's Award goes to Team 53, Mindstorm Mayhem. enjoyed doing robotic kind of things that had science and math and you actually had to think it like critical thinking. And that's what I learned about myself, that I actually liked that. I had a lot of fun doing this whole competition and this day was a highlight of our my whole experience.